Take it easy in there. You're safe now. You're among friends. Dr. Freeman? Gordon Freeman, is that you? You've made it here this quickly? Well, Eli will be absolutely amazed. Oh, you'll have to forgive the scanning process. We can't take any chances. But it shouldn't be much longer now. I'm sorry, I've completely forgotten to introduce myself. I'm Dr. Mossman, Dr. Judith Mossman. Our paths have never actually crossed before, but I feel as if I know you. I've been hearing about you since long before the Black Mesa incident. Oh, that must have been amazing, working so closely with Eli and Dr. Kleiner when they were at the top of their field. Oh, Black Mesa. Oh, there we go. You can come through. Uh, I'll take you to Eli right now. He'd never forgive me if I kept you waiting. And we could certainly use the extra help around here. We've covered a lot of ground in the last few weeks, but things would go much faster if we had more people with your training. We're closing in on a reliable local teleport technology, something the Combine still hasn't mastered. Now, Eli thinks their portals are string based, similar to our Kalabi Gao model, but they fail to factor in dark energy equations. They can tunnel through from their universe, but once they're here, they're dependent on local transportation. If they knew what we were doing with entanglement... Oh. <laughs> Listen to me, I sound like a postdoc. I'm just so excited to think that we'll finally have a chance. What do I remember what feels good by we figured out how to use Zen as an unexpressed axis, effectively a dimensional slingshot, so we can swing around the border world and come back in local space without having to pass through. Oh, here's Eli now. Eli, look who I found in the airlock. I heard, I heard. Gordon Freeman. Let me get a look at you. My God, you haven't changed one iota, man. I've been saying all along, Gordon will come when the time is right. I didn't doubt you for a minute, Eli. Well, come in, come in. You'll feel right at home here. It's Black Mesa writ small. I still recall the first day you joined our team at Black Mesa. Dr. Shiny Penny in your clean white lab coat. And look at you now. The dress coat has relaxed a bit, hasn't it? Well, we've come by some hard roads, haven't we? I count myself lucky to be here at all. Damn few of us have to Black Mesa. What's important is that we survive. Right you are. We'll get you out of that hazard suit and back into your lab coat where you belong. I'll see what I can dig up. Are you two all right for now? We'll be fine. Sure. Dr. Freeman, it's been a real honor. I'm looking forward to working together. Fine scientist, Judith. She would have been at Black Mesa if our budget hadn't been so tight. But you edged her out in light of your work at Innsbruck. It could have been her in the test chamber that day. I don't like to dwell on those days. Pointless. Only thing we can do is press on, try to repair the damage. Here now, this is our teleport. Still trying to figure out exactly what went wrong there. Dad? Dad, this is Alex. Do you read? Alex, honey, where are you? Approaching the south entrance. There's a lot of antlion activity out here, but no sign of Gordon Freeman. Well, as a matter of fact, he's right here with me. What? You're joking. You're serious? How'd he get past me? You can ask him yourself. We're in the lab. All right, Dad, I'll be right there. I, I can't believe he got through... Out. <laughs> You've impressed her. She knows how hard it is out there. If anything would have happened to her... Sorry, Gordon. I know you understand. You might recall at Black Mesa we thought we were a decade away from harnessing the zero-point energy field. Turns out the heavy lifting was done for us by the Combine. This is our zero-point weapon. Our gravity gun built this around a little piece of tech Alex liberated on one of her expeditions. Go ahead and try it. It's got two modes, standard and asymmetric. Try them both. Alex, sweetheart. Hi, Dad. So, where's the troublemaker? I've never seen the antlion so right. I believe you've met Alex. She's my right-hand gal. Oh, you mean old Masi left me a hand? No, no. I'm not starting anything. 
I suppose she already gave him the tour? As a matter of fact, I was showing him around myself. Oh, let me do it, Dad. There's stuff I'd like to ask Gordon. You know, about the old days. Sure, you go ahead. Gordon, you hold on to that zero-point gun for a while. I want Gordon to see what he stirred up. If he's gonna walk in the antlion's den, he might as well learn to tread lightly. I'll bring him back in one piece. You're in the best possible hands. I've gotta say, I think you broke my old record for getting here on foot from Dr. Kleiner's lab. Still, you'd have made better time if you hadn't tried to brute force your way through the antlion zones. There's a subtler way of doing it. Uh-oh. Oh. Hello, Alex. Back already? I, I wonder if you'd excuse us for a minute. Gordon, I wanted to ask you if you could take a look at our portal station. I'm interested in your opinion on the Zen Relay configuration. Uh, Judith? Maybe Dr. Kleiner said something to you about the... We've got somewhere else to be. I excuse me, Alex. Dr. Freeman's presence here is extremely important for the continuation of our work. Which is exactly why I'm making sure he knows the rules of conduct. It's going to be hard to keep hidden if he stirs up the antlions every time he steps outside. Now if you'll excuse us. All right. That's a good point. But bring him to the portal lab as soon as you're done, please. I'll do that. Be careful out there, Gordon. <laughs> so you've met Dr. Murphy. She's one of the reasons you spend so much time outside. Dog, come! Come here, boy. Gordon, this is Dog. My dad built him years ago to keep track of me. Be my little buddy while I was scavenging around. That was the first model. He was about yay high. I've been adding to him ever since. Have a night, boy. Oh my god. Those are scanners. Gordon, get back inside. We've got to warn... They know. Quick, get in. Dad, we just saw a full wave of scanners coming in. I know. We picked them up, too. Where are you now? We're in the airlock. Stuck in a full auto cycle unless someone can override it. Is Gordon with you? Yeah. Good. Well... Dad? Gordon, I want you to stay with Alex. Everyone else knows the evacuation procedures. We're not going anywhere without... Dad? Dad! Damn it! Dog, open the airlock. Get us out of here. Hurry! Now, tear it apart if you have to. Just get it open. Oh, my God. No. My father. Where? No! Where? Use your scouts. Can you see them? Oh, no. Oh, please. Keep watching. Gordon, we have to go after them. Put the word out. Make sure you track them as far as you can. If they change course, we need to know. Come on, Gordon. This way. Thank you.